Hi guys! So, ito na naman ako. May haul. Video na naman ako. I just got back from Japan. So, medyo madami naman akong binili na ganalay. Super nag-enjoy naman kami. Ako, nag-enjoy akong kakakain, kaka-shopping, ang daming cute stuff. So, ang dami kong na-accumulate ngayon from Daiso, um, Muji, and then yung mga drugstores sa Japan. So, biyang ma-overwhelm kasi dami ng stuff nila. So, dahil ang dami kong binili, I guess let's just get started kasi hindi ko rin alam kung saan ako magsisimula. Magsisimula na lang tayo sa mga random knickknacks here and there and then clothing items and then beauty products and then let's move on to Daiso and then Muji. So I think that's how we're gonna do it. Wish me luck. Okay. Sa Japan, uso yung brand na Wego. Hanapin nyo lang to sa Dotonbori. Doon ako nag um, Wego. So yung una na bili ko sa Wego ay socks. I love socks. I think they're so cozy and can never have too many of them because I always lose my socks. First pair na bili ko, black yung base and then may mesh na white. Tapos may nakasulat na first trip embossed right there in rainbow colors which I think is so cute. Tapos ito rin, kumuha din ako ng isa pa. Black siya tapos rainbow yung mesh niya. Which again, super cute lang. So I had to get that. The last pair that I got is a white base with another yung mesh detail nga. Very, very similar yung pair sa nakuha ko kasi parang feel ko ito yung pinaka worth it for the price. Kasi mesh, tapos on dread pa yung mesh right now. So ito yung may watermelon which is sobrang cute. Ito naman sasabi ko, pag nasa Japan ka, hindi mo kayang hindi mapabili kasi parang ang daming bits and pieces that will make you just go, okay, mine. Add to cart. Add to cart, dude. So, ayan nga. These three pairs of socks. So cute. I love them. Ang ganda ng used tsaka ng vintage line nila. Pagpunta ka doon sa pita kamataas na floor na may used yung mga parang ukay-ukay second hand. Pero, in good condition naman. And yung mga vintage. Which I like vintage clothing. I got these things. Nothing too crazy. So, yung first is from the brand Brownie. It says Brownie on the tag. Green yung color niya. Tapos, white yung top itself. Medyo nasa zip siya. Mukha siyang palalaki. Pero, I don't know. I like the zipper detail here. I think it looks so nice. Parang sporty na ewan. So I got this guy. I also got this guy which says Make Merry which I thought was really cute. And the coolest thing is medyo... Ano ba to? Basta textured yung ano niya, font niya na Make Merry. And I thought it was really cute. Wala lang pang film, pang lounge in. Really cute top. And again, very inexpensive. $8.90 yan na lang which is roughly about... For 50 pesos. Tapos may sale pa nga sila. So, I got that one. The last stuff that I got, hindi ko alam kung gusto nyo. Kasi it's like, it's either you're gonna love it or you're gonna hate it. And I love it. I love it. I don't know what it is about it. I just love the look of it. And it's, it looks, it doesn't look appealing. I'm, I'm pretty sure it looks obnoxious to some of you guys. But I love this. It's from the brand Junior Sweet. And it's again a free size. Medyo maroon brown. So, it's green yung color niya. And I thought this was really... I don't know, just vintage. Yeah, vintage is the word to describe it. Very not from this era, and I love that about it. It's like something na pwede ko a pair with high waisted shorts or high waisted jeans, and then just like black mules, and then I'm good to go. Such a classic, just sweatery material with collar. So happy with the tops I got from Wego. As in, check new Wego, guys. As in, so I love Wego so much. The last thing that I got from Wego is the thing I'm most excited for. And probably the thing I would recommend you and I would push you to buy. Like, if you can buy this, if you can still get it on sale right now as we go, or even kahit hindi siya sale, get it. Because it's literally the most comfortable pair of flats I have ever slipped my feet on. Ah! I got black new flats. I'm so happy with these. And actually, yung family members ko sabi na, ang pangit. Ang, ang pangit. Bakit? Why? Fashion, guys. Fashion. I like it. I... I live for these weird looking flats. And they're buying So ngayon. So, sobrang trendy niya. I got it on sale for 1,990 yen, which makes it about 1,000 pesos. That's a steal. Come on, that's literally a steal. The pair looks like this, very classy. I think it's really nice and I don't regret purchasing it. Kapasok pa lang nung pa ako dito, sobrang comfortable. Nagtry ako ng boots, pero ito yung pinili ko kasi sobrang comfortable niya. I cannot wait to wear these on the future trip. Sobrang oh my gosh. So furry and like comfy and pang matagal. Like, ano, may pasosot mo siya pag nagtatravel ka, hindi siya hassle. Hindi mo sarong sasakit yung paa mo, which is the best thing about these. And they're fashionable as well. No, they're not for everyone. Some people are gonna think, what? You don't have any fashion sense. Like, fashion police the best. Pero, I don't know. Caught my attention, caught my eye. I think it's a great pair. 
to buy. Aside from Wego, I have another favorite shop. It's called the 390 yen store, I believe. Everything there that you can find is 390 yen. First item that I got is a neck scarf. Um, just a basic fashion scarf because for like t-shirts lang like this um, it's easy to throw on like a neck scarf or ne a neck piece like this adds like a pop of color if I'm wearing t-shirt lang ako minsan tapos gusto ko lang ng pang inarte kanon ito pwede tong going for your neck piece this last item that I got is probably one of my favorite things that I got ever from the trip it's like when I see that it reminds me of my Japan trip and it just makes me so happy this is a pair of gummy earrings a pair of gummy earrings Haribo gummy earrings in red. Did I say more? I don't think so. I think... Oh my... Oh my god! These just speak for themselves. The cutest little thing ever and so worth the 200 pesos. I can't. If I were to wear this, I feel like at least five people are gonna stop and ask me, Oh my gosh, someone a billion girl. 390 yen store. <laughs> so cute! Another cute little thing is this takoyaki keychain. And it's not just takoyaki, it's takoy it's like species of takoyaki with a container. With it like look. Just just marvel at this goodness right here. Brasa ko bes. Papakita siya. Gusto niya magwakita ng yan. Ayan yung takoyaki, anim na piraso, tapos may ano pa, may may pantusok, tapos may container, tapos kaya. I mean, wag sa bin sa akin na wag ko tong bibilin. Hello, kung pwede ko nga lang to going earrings, ginawa ko na. Like, di ba? Ang cute mo <laughs> kaya. <laughs> Hello! Ang cute nyan! I love this. So cute, so cute. Anyway, kidding aside, I had so much fun playing around with those cute little items. So duty free, pa uwi na kami nito. Bumili ako ng Shoe Mirror Eyelash Curler. Kasi mas mura sa Japan ne. Eh. Um, 1,300 yen. My eyelash curler is about to die, and I don't want to use my backup. So I just kind of opted for this one. I can't wait to try this out because I've heard so many good things about it. And it also comes with an extra cushion, I guess. Um, so yeah, I got that guy. <laughs> so now we're moving on to the beauty products I got from Japan's drugstores. Ang dam silang drugstores na nakakalula. Like, drugstore here, drugstore there. Um, crepe here, crepe there. Daming crepe stores. Daming drugstores. So I kind of went, not really too crazy, but I did get a couple of items na kahit na hindi ko maintindihan yung pinagsasabi nila, eh, binili ko pa rin. Some of these, though, um, nag-research naman ako kung ano yung dapat na binibili sa Japan. So, ito yung mga binili ko. Actually, unahin na natin makeup kasi actually, dalawa lang yung makeup items na binili ko from their drugstores, which, that's, that says a lot. Because, I mean, of course, I had to get a heroin make product that I was gonna stock up on their mascara remover. But most of the drugstores I went to didn't have it. So I opted for the Hair and Make Advanced Film Long and Curl Mascara in brown. Because I already have the black one. So I got the brown one in Japan. And I can't wait. I think it just, you know, it just gives a more natural look. So I love this mascara. It's like my holy grail. Hand Make um, Marshmallow Finish Powder. And when I like saw the word marshmallow, I'm like, yes, marshmallow. Yeah, kahit hindi siya pagkain. You bet I'm still gonna buy it. How do I open this guy? Let's see. This is how the powder looks like. First of all, the packaging is luxurious looking. I got this powder because um, it felt really nice and smooth. Not too much coverage, but I feel like it would make a really nice powder. So I got this guy. Apparently, in Japan, may tax free meaning. Yung mga tourists. Um, you can get their products for tax free, so mas cheap siya kesa if you were like a Japan resident, um, mas mahal siya. So yung yung tax free, pero they have to seal it, and, and you're not able to open the products until you reach your country. So yung yung you know yung downside. I got a bunch of masks. I'm not a mask person, but I got a bunch of masks to try because I've been hearing a lot of good things about the brand Lulu Lun, so I got a bunch of their masks. Ito yung Lulu Lun na Sweet Drop Weekly Face Mask. Ayan. So I think it comes with five sheets. So if I'm not mistaken, once a week shot. So I have five sheets of that. But I also got the Lululun, Lululun, Lululun Seven Days. Um, yung blue, naman. Um, I really can't read this. Pero I think blue. I got the Lululun Precious Red for seven days as well. And then sabi ng Google, ito na yung pinaka okay. So bumili ako ng dalawa. Lululun na silver. So, ayan. Mabili ko niyan. So, medyo madami akong masks na binili. I think this should cover, like, at least two to three months worth of usage. So, ayan. I repurchased a Shiseido Eyelash Curler because this is, um, 500 yen. So, mga 200-something pesos lang. 
and it also came with an eyelash cushion or an eyelash curler cushion and yeah I got that guy bumili din ako ng Biore UV Perfect Milk Sunblock it has SPF 50 PA++++ I love this can you believe I've never tried Biore before? Siguro ako na yung pinakahuling babae sa mundo na hindi pa nakakatay ng Biore. Kasi na nasa Pilipinas naman siya, di ba? Pero ewan ko sa Japan, ko pa siya binili. Like, what? I don't know why. I love this because it mattifies my face. I've been using it constantly ever since I got it. Binuksan ko na siya nasa Japan ako, actually. Madalas ko na rin siya gamitin and I love this. I can't wait to talk about it on a separate video, but I already love this. It's so good. Biore Aqua Rich Watery Essence, which I think bestseller ng Biore. And I haven't used it, but I have swatched yung testing to sa drugstore and mukha siyang very nice and easily absorbed by the skin so I cannot wait to try this out. Tapos yung tanong ako sa friend ko kung ano ba dapat yung binibili ko sa Japan. Tapos sabi niya, mag-stock up daw ako sa Perfect Whip. So I got two of these. I don't know where the other one is but I got two of the Senka Perfect Whip Foaming Cleanser. I believe this is Shiseido as well. Kung hindi ako nagkakamali, Shiseido siya. So yung may 25% more. Siyempre, ganun tayo. Yung 25% more. Um, smells okay naman and it's basically a cleansing foam na talaga nagpo-foam up siya. So, stock up ako kasi super mura lang nito. Pero yun, sana okay siya kasi mukha naman siyang okay siya. Ang laki-laki din niya for the price. Sabi din ni Google, bumili ako nito. Hindi ko nga alam yung brand niya. Pero yung picture niya, ganito yung itsura. I believe the brand is called Sana. And I believe this is either an essence or a lotion, which is like a serum or an essence or, yeah. Something like that, a serum, a toner, an essence, something along those lines. But I got this thing as I Google, it's wrong, dapat must have dawda sa Japan, so bumili ako niyan. I also got Hada Labo products. Everything is in Japanese. Dun ako nahihirapan kasi hindi ko alam. Hindi ko alam yung mga pinagbibibili ko, to be honest. Ah. As in, Google, sa Google lang ako nag-rely. Kung ano yung picture, sinabi ng picture, yun lang. This is the Gokujin, which is hyaluronic acid, uh, which is a very moisturizing kind of acid. I believe. Um, this is an essence, so I got the essence. And then I got the Gokujun. I believe this is their, I don't know, toner or just like serum or whatever that is. This is all super highly raved about. Sabi ng iba kong friends, ito na bilhin ko so bumili ko niyan. Then the last thing that I got is the Hada Labo Gokujun. Um, cleanser. Sana okay yung mga stuff ng Japan, yung mga drugstore beauty items sila. And I have high hopes for the Hada Labo line. So sana okay naman sila. I guess I just wanna say I got a bag as well. Munti ko na akong makalimutan. But yeah, I did get a bag. This is the Anello bag. And this is everywhere. If you go to Japan, you're most likely to see at least one of these. At least 10 of these the streets and I believe authentic naman lahat ng anello ng Japan. Small size lang just for travel, just for you know like a regular backpack. I want to describe the color as a burnt rose old rose color bomber type yung material niya which I really like. When we were packing, um, I stuffed a bunch of things inside this guy and it surprisingly fit a lot of my stuff. So actually I'm pretty impressed with this. This is the bag for me, basically. So in Tokyo we went to this marble <laughs> <laughs> so in Tokyo we went to this marble. <laughs> so in Tokyo we went to this marble exhibition and they had all these superheroes displayed. I mean Doctor Strange costume dots, but oh my god, it's the real thing apparently and I was like, yes, you probably see Benedict Cumberbatch, best and then the best. So, ayun nga. And then they have this like um, store where they were selling like hot toys. I got another Funko Pop. This time it's the regular Doctor Strange um, bobblehead Funko. I already have the Funko Summer exclusive of this guy. But since I'm done, I'm going to buy one more. Just for souvenir purposes. This is called the Legend Series Doctor Strange. Um, build a figure and you can build their mom if you get the entire series of Dr. Strange this is probably the closest I could get to a real looking Benedict Cumberbatch and it doesn't even look like Benedict Cumberbatch I don't know I liked it so I picked it up and I'm so happy with it to be honest they display it today actually I should display but should I display I have it later like so guys ready na ba kayo sa part na to? Daiso! Hashtag Daiso is life. Daiso is literally life. Like, if you don't go to Daiso in Japan, hello, go to Daiso in Japan. It's everything. 
So, bra, everything is there. Para sa department store na may five floors. As in, everything is there. Everything is there. Tami yung parang kahit ang dami ko na binis sa Daiso. I didn't spend too much money. Everything at Daiso is so inexpensive. More inexpensive than the Daiso of the Philippines. I'm just gonna start with the food items that I got. Pop beans. Patani. Yun daw. Patani. So, gumali ako ng patani snack. 100 yen, guys. 100 yen. I got some more snacks. One that I don't even know. I don't even know what this is, but it's from the brand. I also don't know, but 100 yen for this as well. Milk candy with some mint in it, apparently. But I mean, I did like the mint in the end, so I mean. Got some milky caramel candy. It's pretty good. I took a bite and it's, I like it. I like it. Got me some rice cracker snacks because I like rice cracker. Soy sauce flavor and very tasty. Very tasty. These are not from Daiso, but if you happen to find Dar's milk chocolate, get them because they're amazing. They melt in your mouth, especially in white chocolate. They're the best. I got me some grape jelly because I love grape jelly. They're my favorite flavor of jelly, and I love jelly. I love gummy candy, so I got grape jelly. How many times have I said grape jelly? I don't remember, but I got those. I got a bunch of Kewpie and mayonnaise. I love this mayo. It's so good. Tangy but like tasty and flavorful. I love it, so I got three. I love my cute by mayo. All right, all right, next bag, next bag, please, next bag. I got some makeup bags from Daiso, do the same kind. Um, I plan to store makeup in here and then skincare in here. And they're clear, so it's easy for you to locate your skincare mo, your makeup mo, hindi ka na which is which. So I got two. Bumili din ako nitong wash net cleansing whip. Ito naman, sabi ng friend ko, ito daw dapat yung binibili mo kasabay ng perfect whip para magamit mo yung perfect whip ng maayos. And ito parang napapafoam up niya yung cleanser mo. I think these are supposed to be used together. So I got yung net from Daiso. I got a fan. I got one more fan. No. Got one more fan. So I have two fans here with me. First fan has sushi. And it reminds me of Japan. Every time I'm gonna look at this fan, it's gonna bring me back to Japan. So that's the reason why I got it. For the Philippine weather, I think you might want to just do this for the rest of your life. Like, do this. Kahit na mangawit ka, kahit matutulog ka na, di ba, nakaganang ka lang. Kailangan mo ng ganito kasi sobrang init sa kadri natin ngayon. So, one is never enough. I got two fans. I randomly got some ghost sticky notes. So cute. Ghost, guys. Multo. Multo na sticky notes. I think it's so cute. Got this. I got a pencil case that has a popcorn and some Japanese words I can't even pronounce, I can't even read. But the only reason why I got this is because of the Japanese words I can't even read. So that it reminds me that I went to Japan. Beauty products from Daiso. I got a bunch. Espolure BB SPF 50 with four pluses in the shade beige. Um, it's an aerosol foundation for the most part. You shake it up and lalabas yung foundation jan you. you know, and everything. Mukha siyang promising, diba? Aerosol foundation. That's like, hmm, intriguing. I also got the eyebrow top coat that Simply Rays has been raving about. Maganda raw to. So, I got this guy. Tignan natin kung matatame niya or kung maka-hold niya yung eyebrows natin, diba? Kasi medyo gumagalaw-galaw yan, eh. Got a concealer from Daiso. This is from the brand Everbelena. Everbelena. It literally says Everbelena. And my shade is in Ecru. Oh... Okay, kind of liquidy. Di makita pero ayon siya. Mhm. Mm tignan natin, tignan natin sana maganda siya. Bumili din ako ng eyelash glue kasi okay daw yung eyelash glue ng Daiso. So ayan, ting nose highlight powder nila. Ay niya sure niya. Meron din sa Philippines, ha? ito meron sa Philippines. Pero again, mas mura kasi sa Daiso sa Japan. 50 pesos as opposed to 88 sa Philippines. So, I got this one. Some permanent markers from Dice. So, I got a black one and a red one. And, bakit ko kailangan to? It's because I sell makeup and I pack my packages. So, these came in handy. Ito, ito, ito. Bumili ako ng furniture. Na ano ba to? Furniture na repairing sticks and markers. Kasi may dog kami. Kinakalmutin yung doors namin. Eh, wooden yung door namin. May parang paint doon. So, minsan nasis nasira niya. As in, like, nagkaroon ng mga markings and everything. So, bumili ako ng furniture marker and the shade mahogany. Just to correct or para ma at least hindi naman sobrang halata yung parang kalmot niya. So, bumili ako niyan. Tapos, bumili din ako nitong repairing stick and dark. 
para lang siyang crayons. Ito parang pencil pen. Pero ayun nga, kunwara may scratches na yung, ano nyo, furniture nyo. Especially the wood. I think these are so nice. Sa ayos yung door namin na. As in, hindi na masyadong hata ngayon. So, I got these guys. And these are so essential and very handy. I love these so much. Got some tights from Daiso. Um, ito yung sheer tights nila. Yeah, sheer tights. I got a pair. And then, this naman is the color tights. Siguro, I think mas dark. Ito yung mas sheer. I prefer the sheer ones. Pero, I got both because they were really inexpensive. Sobrang cute nito. I got this one, yung origami necklace. Ang ganda niya, diba? Tapos parang, alam mo yung maalala niyo ng Japan pag kinuha niyo yun. So, bumali ako niyan. Dumay din ako ng earrings. Ayan sila. Super cute lang. I got a hand memo clip. So, kung may notes ka dyan or important chuba ek ek na kailangan mong i-clip. Ayan siya. You get what I mean? It's so cute. So, I had to get that. I got a lantern pen. Because, again, sobrang Japan. Sobrang Japan niya. Kaya ko siya kinuha dahil it reminded me so much of the countries. Okay, ready na ba kayo for these? I basically hoarded these, guys. Kasi nag-hoard ako. I have like, I don't know, more than eight pieces of these marble contact sticker sheets. So, how you use this, if you want to dress this up marble, you just stick lang tong sticker sheet na to, tapos magiging marble na to. So, sobrang cool. Marble is very trendy right now. So, I had to get the white one and the black one. As you can see, they are so nice. For furniture, kung you want to add like marble accent, these would be perfect. Ayan sila, how you could use them. So, wallpaper or as the drawers or whatever. So, I got the black and I got some white and I have some backups right there. The best purchase from Daiso ever, ever. La, la, la. Hindi ko alam kung paano ko sila nauwi. I got these drawers to store makeup, yes, or pens. Or pens, or notes, or anything, knickknacks. Not gonna lie, they look like the Muji ones. They're stackable. Three drawer goodness. I mean, hello, guys, please. Ito na yung pinaka okay na. Whoa, whoa, girl, no. 100 pesos lang isa. 100 pesos isa. What? They're not as sturdy as acrylics, but I mean, hello, they can store as many lipsticks as you can. Ayan, ayan siya. Yung itsula niya pag napuno mo na siya ng lipsticks. Please! I'm obsessed with this. Ang ganda guys. Ang ganda talaga. Wala ko masabi. As in, the best. The best. The best. Our last stop was at Shibuya. I got stuff from Muji. And medyo mu mas mura sa Muji sa Japan. Kesa sa Muji sa Philippines. So I kind of went... Not crazy, not crazy at all. Of course, I was at Muji. So I had to get their pens. These are my favorite pens. Ever. I got the black blue one and the black one in 0.7. Gusto ko thick yung pen ko para, I don't know, chubby yung pagsulat ko dun. And gusto ko yung black and blue niya, yung ganito lang. Mura lang siya sa Muji, so I got four of these guys. Got notebooks as well. Ito yung five color notebooks. Yeah, five notebooks sa siya. This is the small one, and you can just like jot your notes or something like that. This guy has like five mini notebooks inside, and I got this one. It's a simple plain black one. I don't know why I got it, but para naman mas maging maayos na yung time management ko and like yung pagplan ko. I just I'm just gonna jot here like my plans for the day or for the year even. So I got these notebooks. I managed to bring these home with me. I'm so happy I was able to bring these home with me. I got two of their, what is this called? Acrylic pots. Yung containers nga, you can put like brushes if you want. Pero I'm gonna put like cotton bud siguro here. Kasi may, con may top case na ganyan para hindi contaminate yung ng dust yung cotton pads mo. So siguro ganyan na lang. Ang ganda diba? Tapos mura mura lang siya. Siguro nasa 150 pesos lang. So I got this is called the pen stand. So if you want to store your pens, you can do so. But if you want to store like brushes or eyeliners, you can definitely do that with this guy. So I got one lang. I should have gotten more because it's 75 pesos lang siya dito sa Pilipinas. You can even store your Q-tips in here. But I thought it was a really nice, just like minimalistic, simplistic idea to store anything. Shampre, I saved the best for last. No, this is not the Muji 5 acrylic drawer. I could, I can never fit that into my luggage. I just got this guy instead. This is, it doesn't even say, it's just like an acrylic case. You can put like your folders in here and whatnot. This is 1,200 yen, so roughly about 600 pesos. If you guessed it, I'm gonna fit my palettes in here. My everyday palette, I think this will be the perfect palette organizer. It's so nice. So I got this guy. I'm so happy with my Muji purchases. 
finally something useful, something I can definitely incorporate and actually use on an everyday basis. So, so happy. Like, I'm so happy about it. Oh my gosh, natapos din tayo. Natatapos din pala ako magsalita, ano. Pero ayun nga, salamat guys. Don't you guys worry. Um, right after this video, I'm filming my 15,000 subscriber giveaway. Do you want to see peak of the prices? Because it's a pretty damn big giveaway. These are what two winners will be winning. I'll be filming it on my next video. So stay tuned for that. Um, yun lang naman guys. Super thank you again for watching. Wait, I'll be back with you later. Thank you. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to keep up with what I do, then follow me on my social media accounts always listed down below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't. Like, hello. Subscribe. Make a YouTube account. Subscribe to my channel. I'm just kidding. Leave a comment down below what you want to see next for this channel. Like, please, I would love to hear your thoughts. I would love to hear you. I would love to hear you speak and just comment. And let's just, like, let's have a conversation. And yeah, I'll be seeing you guys on my next one. Bye! <laughs>